to discuss redox reactions. So, means at a time reduction and oxidation reactions are taking place in a cell. It's called as redox reactions. In redox reactions, first we discuss reduction process. Means the gain of electrons, the gain of electrons is called as reduction and next oxidation process. means the loss of electron is called as oxidation process. In reduction process, generally the reduction process is taking place at a cathode electrode. Oxidation process is taking place at anode electrode. Okay. Now, I discuss first electrolytic cell. In electrolytic cell, example, consider zinc rod is dipped in copper sulfate solution in a beaker. First, I consider one beaker. In that beaker, by place zinc rod. This is the zinc rod. This is your copper sulfate solution. Means two electrodes are dipped in one solution this is a zinc rod okay now if it is zinc so in electrolysis process at cathode at cathode here at cathode means your reduction process is takes place means zn is abstracting, it donating. So it's abstracting, or sorry, it, it is donating two electrons that gives ZN plus two plus two electrons at anode. So copper is abstracting two electrons. Cu plus two is abstracting two electrons converted to Cu. So the balancing of this equation here two electrons, here two electrons are cancels. We are getting ZN plus Cu plus 2 that is your left hand side on equilibrium with the right hand side is Zn plus 2 with Cu means in electrolytic cell the total zinc rod means the metallic rod is dipped in one solution there is a no use of salt bits but whereas in electrochemical cell in electrochemical cell we use two different solutions by consider two different electrodes by placing of salt bits. So, in electrochemical cell, we this electrochemical cell best example is galvanic cell. The arrangement of galvanic cell or electrochemical cell is so if you consider two beakers. In first beaker, here place zinc rod in zinc sulfate solution. Place in zinc sulfate solution. This is your zinc rod. And similarly, if you consider another electrode that is dipped in copper sulfate solution this is your copper rod these two are connected to a battery battery the two different solutions are connected with the help of salt bridge 
which contain porous plug so this is your salt beads Generally, this salt bridge is made up of with potassium chloride plus potassium nitrate, KCl plus KNO3. Okay, this is the arrangement of electrochemical cell. This is carries positive charge. This is your negative charge. So, arrangement of electrochemical cell. Now, in this electrochemical cell, you are considered same. One is cathode electrode and one is anode electrode. Generally, at an anode. At anode, oxidation reaction is takes place. That is, Zn lost two electrons. Zn plus two plus two electrons. This is our oxidation reaction. Next, at cathode, is reduction process. It means those two electrons are gained by copper. It converted to Cu. Next, here two electrons. Here two electrons are cancels. We are getting Zn plus Cu plus 2 means metal and metallic ion is with Zn plus 2 plus Cu. This is your net reaction. Okay. At anode, generally at anode, this is your off cell reaction. This is also off cell reaction. So off cell. Half cell of oxidation reaction and this one is half cell of reduction reaction. Okay. So this is your net reaction. So half cell oxidation reaction means the loss of electrons at electrode is called as half cell oxidation reaction the gain of electrons at electrode is called as half cell reduction reactions okay the combination of half cell oxidation and reduction we are getting net reaction okay so this is the example for electrochemical cell so generally electrochemical cell is represented in a equation that is for example Zn with vertical line with Zn plus 2 ions and if these two electrodes are separated by a salt bridge next follows metallic ion solution with vertical line next Cu means the first one is this one is oxidation process this is your reduction process this is your anode electrode this is cathode electrode and now we represent now representation of electrochemical cell okay how to represent electrochemical cell so what are the steps are involved in electrochemical cell so representation okay so in that two electrodes so two different electrodes one is cathode and another one is anode electrode okay the in while representation of electrochemical cell in that first right anode electrode follows cathode electrode means the anode electrode is represented with left hand side cathode electrode is represented on right hand side in anode electrode first right metal in that first right metal follows metallic ion metallic ionic solution the metal and metallic ionic solutions are separated by a vertical line and next in cathode electrode
फर्स्ट राइट मेटल मेटालिक आयानिक सोल्यूशन फॉलोस मेटल दीज टू आर सपरेटेड बै ए वर्टिकल लाइन नौ दोड एलेक्ट्रोड एंड कैथोड एलेक्ट्रोड दीज टू आर सपरेटेड बै ए डबल वर्टिकल लाइन डबल वर्टिकल लाइन so this double vertical line is nothing but your salt bridge for example if you write if you consider zinc zinc metal is dipped in zinc sulfate solution and copper metal is dipped in copper sulfate solutions so two different solutions are considered by considering of two different electrodes in that zinc is act as oxidation here this is act as reduction means in that oxidation process first write which one are metal means zinc follows metallic ion means zn plus 2 these two are separated by vertical line this is which electrode anode electrode and next in cathode electrode the loss of electrons means cu plus 2 means metallic ion follows metal these two are separated by single vertical line this is cathode electrode these two are separated by a double vertical line that is salt bridge this is a example for representation of electrochemical cell one for example if you write another example iron is dipped in iron sulfate solution and copper is dipped in copper sulfate solution here iron is act as anode electrode means it is deposited anode copper is deposited cathode means while representation of the in this method first write metal follows metal ion here iron so iron means fe follows fe plus 2 these two are separated vertical line that is your anode electrode and next anode electrode after right which one cathode electrode in that cathode electrode here is cu so cu plus 2 with metal solution follows single vertical line this anode and cathode these two are separated by double vertical line 